What's up guys, welcome to the Spear Project. Right now I'm at Midgetville, which I said in the last video. I'm actually here with my second guest, John. If you guys see my, if you guys saw my vlog channel, TJ's vlogs, he was actually in the man who exposed the government. But yeah, right now we are at Midgetville. I'm gonna give you guys a little brief history. And uh, right now we are parked on private property, so I'm gonna try to get in and get out. And uh, it's gonna be a short video. Midgetville in Ridley, Pennsylvania, Delaware County. In Delaware County, there are many urban legends, such as Satansville, Downingtown Twin Tunnels, and Midgetville. I heard about Midgetville when I was a kid, and not much is heard or even known about Midgetville. There's only a few urban legends that come to mind. For example, if you're walking through Midgetville by yourself, you will encounter a group of midgets. They will chase you by throwing sticks and stones at you until you are no longer vulnerable. I've also heard that there are a few midgets that kidnap you stone you to death. The little joke that we, all, we were always told as kids, if you go to Midgetville and you get pelted with rocks and sticks, you can go to the hospital right across the street. Today, I decided to go to Midgetville and I'm going to find out how small these places really are. Also, on a side note, there is a Midgetville in many different parts of the United States, such as New Jersey, Kentucky, and New York. So, are there really midgets? It's this way. Yeah, that's that's a different one. But you're going to see like. The legend here is basically people would walk back here and there would be like a midget who would chase them out with sticks and rocks. And the joke is that like since the hospital's right across the street, that's where people would go just to get like treated because of the, you know, midgets chasing them. Yeah. But yeah, so these houses are very small. I've been here before. Um it's John's first time, and urban legend is that, see the windows? Like, see how small the windows are, right? I got security cameras, too. Right here. So anyways, yeah. Evidently, Midgets used to live back here, and it's a really small place, and they have small doors that you can see in some houses, like for example this one. But people do live back here, like so. Technically, this is like trespassing on private property. You know what I mean? Yeah. But we're just urban explorers. Look. I know. It's nuts, isn't it? I climb once that, yeah. Look at the windows, like. Now this isn't Midgetville in New Jersey, because there is a Midgetville in New Jersey, but we're in PA, so you know, put two and two together. Look at this house, dude. Yeah. Like these houses are so small, like I would honestly like to go exploring in one of them, but you know, you really yeah, can't. Yeah. yeah. Private driveway, no turn around. So 
So yeah, that's really, that's really it. So, yeah. But yeah, these houses are very small and we have midgets that come out and attack us, which is a false rumor, but you know, that could have happened back in the 1600s. You know. I really would like to go exploring in these houses, though. You probably have to, like, bend down. But you see how overgrown this grass is, too, right? Like, it's really not... It's abandoned. That house is probably abandoned. Sure. Oh, yeah. No doubt. Is that even a house? What? That? Yeah. It's a garage house. <laughs> but... See on the, bless you. On this side, these houses are normal. And then on this side, it's small, average, small. There was also a story, it was about a little kid. So basically there was a kid that lived here and people thought that he was a midget and they would chase him they, like they, they would beat this kid up and the kid would chase him out. It was really bizarre. Oh shit. Camera's down. She saw me. That looks like a midget right there, midgetville area. Yeah, it actually does kind of look like a small. Huh? Oh. We'll be fine. We're going to leave anyways. But, um, yeah. That was Midgetville. It's a very small place. And it really... Really, there's not much to it, to be honest. Alright guys, that's going to wrap up for today's video. Um, if you guys enjoyed it, make sure you please smash that like button and subscribe. Uh, tonight, I'm going to Dull Kennel Road. I'm going to bring my friend Kyle with us. We're going to be doing ghost hunting, maybe a Ouija board. Because I did personally make one somewhere back there. And... Uh, yeah, you know, we'll be doing a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, I write a whole bunch of numbers for my job. Just give me one second to flip through these pages. You probably gotta cut this whole part out, aren't you? Yeah. Aha! Ouija board. I made my own the other day. So, um, yeah, short little trip today. I knew it was going to be a, a short video, but in any event, smash the like button, subscribe for more content. Uh, we'll be doing a whole bunch of stuff and Dog Kennel Road tonight. Devil's Gates is going to be coming up soon. I may bring Bob with me and then uh, we'll go from there. So, uh, peace.